behind the scenes of the brand new Careers with STEM Code magazine, we got to visit the coolest offices we've ever seen. Google HQ, right here in Sydney. There's puzzles, a video games room, even a secret passageway hidden behind a bookshelf. In this forward-thinking workplace, we had to investigate. What can these Googlers tell us about the jobs of the future? Meet Marie Claire. So, is your job a job of the future? Totally. Um, being a creative in the tech industry is super fun. You get to work on so many different things, software, hardware, anything you like. Meet Fontaine. So Fontaine, what are some of the skills we need for the jobs of the future? I think the most valuable skill for future jobs is actually the ability to learn. So when you're encountering something that you've never seen before, if you get excited by it instead of scared by it, I think that's a really cool trait to have for the jobs of the future. This is Joelle. What do you think the jobs of tomorrow are going to look like? I think the easiest way to think about it for something that you can't imagine is just, just take what we already know and change it. So I think the jobs of tomorrow will be a lot like the jobs of today, but different. There'll be newer versions of the same things. There'll be new things in the same way that the jobs of today were new 10 years ago. This is Tina. This is where she eats her free lunch every day. What are the skills students need for future jobs? I think computational thinking is a great skill to have. And I think it should be taught in schools in the same way maths and English are taught in schools. And it's a skill that I use every day in my job and it helps me solve problems and use logic to program and make stuff happen. Say hello to Deepa. So Deepa, what are the best traits students can have for future jobs? Curiosity. Be very, very curious. Look around, see what, you, what the world does and then try to make it even better. This is Adrian. Is your job a job of the future? Sure my job is a job of the future because it's all about automating away the boring stuff so that I can focus on the really challenging things that matter.